here ever since. And and uh, the the sort of long drive that go in from traveling from St. Louis to Texas. What what is sort of the I guess going putting uh, everyone who's listening in your shoes. Like what's sort of the pitfalls that comes with like making those long drives. Like the negatives or the positives? Uh, well, well, you can do a little bit of both. A little bit of both. Um, the negative would be probably like, like as much as I love traveling and everything. You know, I'm, you know, I'm married. You know, I have stuff going on at home. So like recently, over the last couple of years, like I love traveling as much as I love you know coming home and just being lazy on the couch for a day or two. Because like obviously mm-hmm. with the travel and you know how much you put your body through the whole time. And then, like, say you have a really grueling match or, you, you know, something goes wrong, you're sore or hurt, you're still 14 hours away from home. So you got to be uncomfortable for 14 hours until you get any kind of, you know, stretchability or stretching or even sometimes right. showers, you know. So mm-hmm. those are some of the negatives. Some of the positives are just pretty much it's like the parents are out of town in the car ride and there's no adults. So a whole bunch of goofball kids are just having a great time being jerk offs <laughs> and doing whatever they want, per se. That's all, and it's sort of, I guess, the whole – a lot of people talk about wrestling sort of building, like, friendships and everyone sort of, like, becoming family. And you would – I guess you would say that the travel in those long distances sort of, like, aids in that aspect. Yeah, you definitely get to know anybody you're traveling with. Like, me, Pierre, Evan, like, we've known each other for a long time now. And then, you know, we started bringing Davey Vega down. He was a local guy, but, like, I didn't know him as well now, but now he's pretty much family to me. Like, you know, obviously he's – like a brother to me. And then we start bringing Matt Fidget down. And I believe like back in the early days, of ACW, like Dingo was down, going down a lot too. I, mm. uh, I actually give a lot of credit to Dingo helped me out a lot in my career too. Cause like, he's one of the people that like him and Adam Raw, like two guys that really helped me like become the character I am today with like me being aggressive and everything.